my friends again with a video series for the uh, tutorial for uh, explaining everything and exploring every single detail of the uh, series of programming using ladder logic here in this video we're gonna talk about uh, a new project this project is the uh, door of garage or you can say door of uh, shop of uh, or store or you can find the electrical door everywhere where you go so uh, let's see here in this uh, garage door for your uh, own mention or mansion or your house so here uh, what we have here we have here as usual uh, uh, this door and this door uh, uh, driven by two motors one motor for uh, raise it up and one motor for uh, close it down so we have open close request so one switch for open one switch for close and so at any time if we have any problem we have also uh, as an input uh, we have uh, this uh, open close we have uh, stop and we have also as an input the limit switch in the uh, top and on the bottom so this limit switch will uh, like uh, 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 I, I identifying or detecting the start and end position of your uh, door to save the, the motor because if uh, if the motor continue opening until the end so uh, the resistance or the load will be overloading to the motor and the motor will blown up so uh, also same thing if we close until the end and continue closing so the motor will uh, damage so here Again, we have input and output. So the input is this uh, push button for open, close, stop, and the, this limit switches for uh, the start and the end or the limits of the uh, door to be uh, open and to be closed all the way here and there. And also for the output, we have uh, the motor to motor direction on motor uh, to uh, motor direction for up and down, and also we have indicator showing the uh, it is open or it is shut down or it is like Azure or something like that. So let's uh, go with our project here. So every time I'm telling you, you list the IOs uh, and after listing these IOs, you decide the addresses of each thing. So I here uh, drawing this uh, this uh, image so you, you can see here the uh, each input uh, you can see like the open uh, will be as input of I10 and close will be I10 and the stop will be I, uh, I12 and for the output you, you have uh, yeah for the limit switch I13 and for, for the, uh, the limit switches and for the uh, output you have for the motor uh, auto uh, 0 and auto 1 and you have for the indicator auto 3 4 and auto 2 also so let's starting our project so going to the uh, ladder logic so here is the uh, let's say the open command and this is the output command so here i can drag and drop uh, for easy this is open request and this is the motor to open uh, up so i take this but let's see here i want to show you if uh, i just decide this is a program to open the door to see what's going on or make it uh, like uh, this is a very very uh, naive uh, thinking to have the input and the output and this is for closing and this is a motor for down so this is down motor and this is for closing the motor uh, as well let's see if the open close will work or not so let's see here so i'm going to download the program and i'm going to uh, be online and try to open you can see because now uh, the program now I requesting open and the motor you can see we need a latch okay let's make a latch here so I'm showing you uh, all detail of programming that uh, you can do same thing like me so here going back to the uh, the tools where in which you can find tools for programming this is a parallel uh, branch and this is for the open and this is for latching you can take this uh, here and take this for the latching and see what's going on here and then the first uh, same thing for the for the that guy so here we need to uh, parent branch and we need to have this one so this one for 
here and this one will be here and here. okay and take this address for the latching so i have latching for open the door and close now so download the program and i want to show you if i didn't consider the limitation of the uh the end of the uh, start and end with this limit switch what's going on to the motor so if you would do like this and just run the program and make open like this it continue open no problem but let's see let's see let's see let's see let's see, let's see, let's see what happened when it reached to the end of uh, its place oh see what happened what happened is like we overloading on the pro uh, on the motor so the motor is damaged as you can see okay which is very bad again you can see very bad approach closing this thing so yeah so fire detected and a problem happened so let's see let's see clean this thing or find this thing also if we trying uh, the closing it will be having the same thing like continue closing like if i make this thing like close it will continue closing okay and because there is no uh, limitation or restriction so it is uh, gonna uh, uh, blown up so here we just need to uh, add some logic here so I need this one to in in the uh, operation of the uh, of the uh, opening. So this one would be here. So once this one is uh, is on, that means stop the opening. And same thing here. I need another one here. So I need this one. So also for for closing, I will stop if this one is. Uh, is, is not because in this direction so in this direction uh, this one I need to continue closing until this one is uh, not active but if this one is active it will but let's see if this is correct or not but we still need to adding this stop so now downloading okay so let's see what's going on if I want to open continue opening it's a work so now once it reaching to the limit switch so the limit switch stops this one if i continue like open this this so i want three here like uh, because it is now uh, uh, not in a rest so uh, because it is normally closed at first but now because it is coming green so that means it will be uh, open same thing here as you can see uh, for closing let's test the closing continue closing but no stop so i i need to implement this stop so also stop is okay now okay so if i continue stop like this you can see you can see it's uh, i'm sorry uh, closing like this so i i want for can't work okay that's fine so I, I realize now this one is uh, uh, normally closed, okay, and this one is normally open, okay. So I need to add this uh, close. So I just adding here another restriction like this one. It will be like this, and I will take this close, okay, and same thing here. It will be like this, and I take this close here close and try my program again so now if i open like this open oh okay wow i think i think i have done this this one it should be uh, because it is normally closed so it should be uh, normally open so this one i remove this one and the, and the put normally open like this i'm so sorry so this is one and the other one of this will be like this so this is or like this so i think now it's okay so 
So now opening, and at any time you can stop and continue. Stop and continue. So close, stop, close, stop. So now it's working. So I need to this indicator, the last thing in my program. So I just make a better branch for this one. Okay. Or I can make a, another run here. So this one is uh, is for opening, and I can add another one. Like this one it will be here. Okay, and here's this branch also. I will add here a branch. Wow. I can add a branch here. So this one is here. And also this one will be here. So I can take this is for open. And this one for shutdown. Okay. And I don't know what is Azure. I, uh, I don't care about it, I just want to show you this uh, this one. So, this is the final step in my program. So now, we need uh, open. So, as the door is opening, so this indicator is on. Okay? And if the door is closing, or oh, you can't open and close at the same time. Yo, we discovered another problem here. Like uh, a short a short circuit, it, it it having a short circuit here, so you can't open and close at the same time. Okay, you should stop and then close. Okay, so close here is working with the indicator, but I found another problem. Like you can uh, start opening while there is a, a closing in in request. Okay, so what I'm gonna do is I will put here. I will put here a, another. Uh, one like this one, okay. And I put also here another restriction. And I take if this motor is working, so you can't run this one. If this motor is working, you can't run this one. Uh, I I discovered this uh, by by uh, by chance while I'm trying, but it should be considering for avoiding a short circuit on the power supply of the motor. Uh, that drives uh, the door. So now I can open the door, close the door, nothing, okay? Nothing. You can't close the door while opening, okay? But you can stop and then request closing. You can't open the door while you, you can stop and then go, okay? Stop and then go. But you can't, yeah. Now it's perfect. Our program, thank you guys for watching and follow up with me today. I hope you, uh, like uh, understanding and enjoying the video and the uh, increasing your knowledge and the practice also and please yeah you can stop the the video at any time and trying to write yourself this simple program and enjoy your practice thank you very much goodbye